In today's video, I am going to share with you a list of all the restaurants in the Fairview area where they are located within the complex and a bit of their menu offerings. You can save the video as a restaurant guide for your next trip to Fairview Montego Bay. Fairview Shopping Center is an amalgamation of everything mobile. I promise I'm not exaggerating. Every major bank, clothing store, and restaurant has either relocated to or opened another store in this rapidly expanding commercial area. If you are in Montego Bay, it is inevitable that you will find yourself out at the Fairview Shopping Complex, whether for business or pleasure. And when you are out here getting all your ducks in a row, you are bound to become hungry. There are a variety of ways in which you can satiate your hunger or thirst as the food offerings in this area varies immensely. Let's start from the end of the Fairview Town Center that borders Bogue Main Road and Alice Eldemara Drive. First up is KC for some scrumptious fried chicken and as I have learned over the years from many people across the world, Jamaican KFC is the bomb diggity. It should be noted that the video at this point will be in the reverse. Right beside KFC is Pizza Hut. This branch offers takeaway and delivery service. After you are finished with your meal, whether fried chicken or pizza, you can hop on over to Tutti Frutti for some frozen yogurt. And depending on how healthy your appetite is, you can top that off with some big treat. Just a hop and a skip away, we have Dragon Court Restaurant, where you can dig into some sweet and sour chicken or pork, special fried rice and dim sum. Down the road, we have Jerky's Bar and Grill, where as the name suggests, you can dig into some jerk chicken. Across the street, we have the Annex Plaza, which is new to Fairview. There are quite a few restaurants here. Upstairs is the Friends Restaurant. The sign reads vegan meat and seafood, and that's what they offer. Just below, we have Roly Poly, where you have a variety of ice cream options. Next to them, we have Subway, and I'll assume you know Subway's menu offerings. Nope. Okay. Think six meatball sub, sweet onion teriyaki chicken, and lace potato chips as a side. <laughs> Besides Subway, we have Mother's, a Jamaican restaurant chain where you can get breakfast meals, burgers, fried chicken, and of course, patty. And over on this side, we have Luca, an Italian restaurant offering stove oven pizzas and pastas. Now let's go to the next section of the plaza where we have Wendy's, a fast food burger chain that offers shakes and chili and baked potato side dishes. If you are craving a traditional Jamaican meal then you will be pleased to sink your teeth into a buttery golden colored flaky shell filled with juicy flavorful and piping hot minced meat. This Jamaican treat is called patty on the right, we have Domino's Pizza, and to the right of that, we have the Chinese Kung Fu Restaurant. Then over to Fontana we go. Inside Fontana, there's Cafe Blue, where you can get smoothies, shakes, wraps, panini, mochaccino, and much more. Beside Cafe Blue is Scoops, where you can get some ice cream. At the left of Fontana, we hop on over to Old Joe's for traditional Jamaican breakfast and lunch dishes. Beside them, we have Sakura Express for dishes like shrimp lo mein and sesame chicken. I'm going to walk straight on ahead past Lloyd's and Quartz, then across the street to have a look at some of the restaurants on that side. But first, it should be noted that the Progressive Supermarket also sells uh, traditional Jamaican lunch meals. Now across the street we go. 
First up is the Ali Cafe for planting barbecue bean wrap, flatbreads, paninis, and smoothies. Right beside them, we have Encore West, where you have a wine bar plus Caribbean, international, and Jamaican cuisines. One popular menu item is the Lamb's Burger. To the left, we have Mystic Thigh, where you can get lavender martini, dim sum, and dal, to name a few menu items. To the left of them, we have Starbucks Coffee, of which there is another branch on Hip Strip, and I think everyone knows what Starbucks has to offer. So moving on. Turn to the right and walk down the road and straight ahead you will see the G West building. Pretty hard to miss. On the first floor of the G West building, we have Corn Med Pharmacy. Inside the pharmacy, there's a restaurant that offers traditional Jamaican meal options. On your way out of G West, turn right until you get to this intersection. We're going to the Icon Fairview Mall, and this is a word spelling of Fairview. I'm not sure if it was done on purpose. At the Icon Fairview Mall, we have our main sandwich master for some more traditional Jamaican meals. Hop on over back to the main road where we saw the Icon Mall sign and go down the road. Here we have another plaza that houses three restaurants. First, the 5050 Lounge, which is a restaurant and a hookah bar. Then we have Sweet Spice. I visited this restaurant in my first Fairview tour video. Their menu options include traditional Jamaican meals like brown stew fish, curry goat, and barbecue chicken, stew pork, and cow food with rice and peas. They also sell smoothies and Jamaican sweet It's treats. called Cafe Mocha, so I'm just gonna do a quick stop inside. Besides Sweet Spice, we have Mocha Restaurant and Cafe, and kind of call them Cafe Mocha. Uh, they have like hot chocolate, mochaccino, chicken they have sandwiches. sandwiches. They have chicken sandwiches, sandwiches. Which one people more? Chicken club sandwich. They have the chicken breast, lettuce, cheese, and all of that in it. Okay. So that's it, my lovelies. Uh, all the restaurants in the Fairview Shopping Center, the Fairview Town Center, and if I missed any restaurant, please just add that in the comment section below and just add a list of their menu offerings. And thank you very much for watching if you're interested in seeing the G West video or the video, my first video of the Fairview Complex. You can go ahead and look at those as well. Okay, thank you very much for watching my sunshines. Remember, if you're my tribe, then subscribe. You know what to do. Hit that button and turn it blue. <laughs>